Hi there, everybody. We're at Villa Park today. Alan Smith and myself, Martin Tyler. And thanks for joining us for this game. And here we've got for you today, Aston Villa against Queen's Park Rangers. The Aston Villa team for this game. Alan Hutton starts with Neil Taylor as the full-backs and they'll play with a sole striker. Well, this is the Queen's Park Rangers lineup. I think that back four is really important for them. They've got to be strong and solid, but they've got a bit of protection, haven't they? They have. They should have more than enough. I mean, they're all good defenders in their own rights, but uh, in front of them, they've got players who are going to be working really hard. Whether they can be a, a fit on the front foot, we'll wait and see. First half started by Aston Villa. There's a dangerous feel to this attack. It's looking good from their point of view. Striding forward purposefully. Trying to get the cross in. Well blocked by the defender. Corner for Aston Villa. Corner's taken. Could get his cross in now. Way over hit that cross. Gone out for a throw. Well, that'll be a throw. Jeff Cameron. Jake Bidwell. Saw the pass coming and got there first. Good work, really, to read the intention of the pass. And in he goes with the tackle. That's his game, isn't it? Intercepting. The ref wants to play the advantage. He's had a look at the ref. He knows what's coming. It's yellow, and the referee's showing no early mercy here. Yeah, not an ideal one, that, for the player. He'll have to be careful with his challenges now. Look again, Alan, at this, the slide tackle that went wrong. Well, one or two people in the crowd howling for him to be punished for that. Certainly didn't get the ball. They've been playing some good football, and if he can tuck away this free kick, that's going to do them no end of good. Let's fly! That was perfection. Pretty much unstoppable, even though they'd set up their wall quite well. The keeper got nowhere near it. No, he was just standing and staring. It was right in the corner. So the first goal, it's 1-0. James Chester.
Yannick Polassi. Taylor. Here's Taylor. Connor Hurihan. McGinn. Trying to find an opening. Not panicking. He can lay it off to the supporting player. Jeff Cameron. Jake Bidwell. Cameron. Luke Freeman. Wells. Up for grabs here. There's still danger here after this half clearance. Under some pressure, he shielded it well. Opening them up with a through pass. Brilliant pass. Can he finish it? Cleared away by the defender. Good defending with the pressure still on. To level it up now. Really good defending. If he hadn't touched it, it was a goal. Now, one of the keepers thanking him for that bit of closing down by his defender. Corner swung in. Good defensive clearance there. Hutton. Want to use the full width of the pitch now, the team in possession all the time against a dogged defensive unit that they're facing at the moment. And now the goalkeeper can maybe think about starting an attack. Jake Bidwell. Freeman. Luke Freeman. A oh, space to get the cross in. McGinn. Connor Hurihan. Jake Bidwell. Jeff Cameron. Put into the middle. Very straightforward piece of goalkeeping as he catches the cross. Now he's looking for support. Well, they look promising there. Free kick given. He's normally good from these set plays and uh, his teammates are expecting a good ball in. Oh, that's good defending. Luke Freeman. He could cross it now. Now, this is an interesting attack. And that certainly helps the goalkeeper and those in the middle to stop the cross like that. Yannick Polassi. That's an easy cutout for the opposition saw the pass coming. Jeff Cameron, Cameron, Wells, got the tackle in. He's cut it out. Hutton, McGinn, Connor Hurihan. Short passes, but they're keeping the ball. Made a quick interception. Joel Lynch. Three minutes to be added on. Yannick Polassi. Put in from the wide area.
Oh, very easy for the goalkeeper there. Just read the intentions of the opposition there to make the interception. And that's half-time. Signalled by the referee, 1-0 the half-time score. Well, the player that we're featuring here has done well. He's certainly been an influence on this first half. Well, he played really well, didn't he? And he got himself a goal to put his team ahead. He'll be pleased with that first 45 minutes. First half started by Aston Villa. The ref wants to play the advantage. The second half is off and underway. The referee had a good look at that, decided it's just a throw after the tackle. Joel Lynch. And there is some uh, back shots on here. Still a chance in there off the goalkeeper. Again. Well, that save, Martin, that could be a key moment in this game because I think it would have been all over if he'd have let that one in. What a stop. Yannick Volasi. And here's the shot. And the goalkeeper read it easily. Threads it through. No, it's offside. Wells. Furlong. And now he's looking for some support. Typified the competitive nature of this game, that tackle. It's only a throw in. Got his foot in to cut out the pass. There's going to be some uh, alteration to the structure for Villa. The substitute's going to come on. Yannick Volasi. Going forward well. Done well under pressure here to... Oh, he's through. Yannick Volasi. They've set it up well for the cross. He's a good crosser normally, but... And the referee has given the free kick. Well, the manager not wasting any time here. He's going to make the change. And they are going to try and turn this around. Is he going to be an in-swinger or an out-swinger? He can deliver these with both feet. Curled in. Defended well. Connor Hurihan. Yedinak. He could cross it now. Whipped in from the wide area. Done well to get it wide. Not done so well with the delivery from the wide areas. In goes the corner. Well, they've got a corner out of that. A bit lucky. It was deflected. Corner's taken. Good defensive clearance there. Shot on! Connor Hurihan. 
Yedinak. Trying to find an opening. Not panicking. Strong challenge. Excellent interception. Well, they're sitting off the opposition here, and that can invite pressure. Cameron. Jeff Cameron. Cameron. Furlong. Jeff Cameron. Another shot. Oh, that's great work by the goalkeeper. Yannick Polassi. Chance to cross it. Now, this is an interesting attack. Gets his cross in. And that shot's blocked very quickly. Cleared away, well away from goal. Well, it's hard to shut up shop, even with a substitution here, but that's what he's going to try to do, I think. It's a good cross. Now it's a good crossing position, but not a good cross. And it's going to be his throw here. Yannick Polassi. It's one back. Here's a chance to whip it in. That's a corner. Swung in from the corner, and they get it away. Yeah, it's gone out of play, and it will be a throw from that uh, headed clearance. Luke Freeman. Put into the middle. Cleared away by the defender. Now the possibility for a cross. And here's the shot. He's had a real go. It's a decent effort, that, with plenty of sting in it. Yeah, not far away. He really did fizz it, didn't he? Well, the clock's showing uh, nine minutes left to play. Right from the beginning, we've never known which way this game is going to go. And the referee says, that's a free kick. Time is ticking away here, and they haven't got too much of it left to deal in. The fans, though, racking up the atmosphere. Yeah, just important now that they don't launch long balls forward, that they keep their patience and try and fashion an opening. Queen's Park Rangers busy on the bench and the change is going to take place. Lynch. Wells. He's got support here. We're down now to the final two minutes of the 90. Lost the ball. Three minutes, that's what's going to be played for added time. Well, the noise in here. These fans, they're like the 12th man trying to G their players up. Yedinak. It's a, a good-looking attack, this one. It might be a final attack as they look for this equaliser. Well, he has got a chance to get the cross in. Good defensive clearance there. It's not really a way. Poor clearance. Poor on the ball. Referee says, that's that. 
beaten here, but uh, I must say they can hold their heads up as they go off the pitch. They gave it everything. Yeah, and you can bet your life the manager in the post-match interviews will be focusing on the positive aspects of that display. Well, I think he was the best performer in a good team today. Yep, he gave those defenders a torrid time out there. Got the goal, the all-important one, and had loads of chances. First half started by Aston Villa. 